What is going on everybody? Welcome back to EU4 as of Venice. So far we have not made it through very long, which is a little concerning because this series, you know, the current pace is probably going to go on forever. But there we go, we'll, we'll, we'll figure it out uh, somehow. But so far our war, obviously we're caught in that mixed point because sometimes, you know, it's very difficult to plan these things. Sometimes they can end incredibly uh, quickly. Uh, France would like access. Who are they at war with? Milan, Savoy, all these people. Yeah, go on, they're all in Italy. Um, yep. Whoever that is, that was not Aragon. It looked like it, but it was not. <laughs> a lot of truces ending, okay. But yeah, so far, so... Where is my other military? Where's the other stack of troops? Did they die? This is concerning. Where is this three stack? Am I... Oh, they're on a boat, okay. What do you do? Oh, the Ottomans are fighting Naples. Let's get military tech level four there. Okay, good. And, oh, probably shouldn't have done that mid-war. Never mind. Serbia will give me war reps. That is not enough right now, Serbia. I'm so sorry, but <laughs> we're going to need a little more than that. Right, you get off that transport. Thank you. We can enact a government reform. I don't know which one to do, so maybe I'll wait. I don't think I'll check if we had a comment on that, but I don't think we've had one, so I will I'll have a look now. But if we have had one telling me to pick, that would help. Because apparently I picked wrong last time. We have not called these. I called these. What the heck? Oh, no. It's because I made them into states, didn't I? Okay. Well, we'll do that again. We also still need to deal with the rebels in Crete. I'll hopefully have time to get down there. Hopefully. But yeah, the Ottomans are in a pretty big war. We'll see how it goes for them. Poland, Lithuania, Naples. So we'll see how that goes. Um, pretty, pretty big event. We'll keep an eye on it. Where is it on here? This is it. And yeah, the Ottomans losing right now. If these guys could win, that would be great. Just slow, even if we just slow them down. But yeah, you can see Poland's here winning right next to us. And we're making our own progress. Right, so let's kill this Serbian two stack. Go on, you got this. They'll probably lose. <laughs> yep, another, oh no, minus two plus two. That's, that all balances out okay. Uh, right, here we go. Let me have a look. Comments, comments. Okay. Um, five to ten years on the rebels, so we're fine. For tier three, all government reforms are okay. Okay, there we go. Perfect. That is. Oh, we got some rebels. We'll deal with those. Where are they? Oh, 13 stat. That's pretty big. Hopefully, we can get to them as well. Um, right, government reform. They're all good, apparently, but this is not available. Um, so we'll ignore those two. Consolidation of power will give a maximum absolutism plus 10. Consolidate power in the doge. Governing capacity. I'm sure that's not how you say that. Maybe it is. I don't know. Governing capacity plus 250. I was told we have low governing capacity, right? As Venice. That was a comment. So maybe I should go with that. Or we could get some more trade power. Term duration for diplomatic relations. Uh, let's consolidate power. There we go. Let's get some more governing capacity. Because I was told that was low. So... Sounds like a good plan. Come on, finish this siege, and I can try to deal with the rebels. There we go. Right, that's up to 63%. In fact, I should be able to separate piece Serbia this time. Although, my, I might not be able. No, that's Byzantium. We haven't even got there yet. Just you, Serbia. Zeta and Kosovo. We won't take any more, because it looks like we're getting a bit too big. We're struggling with the rebels a bit, so we'll take some war reps. Everything else... There we go, we add Zeta and Kosovo, we get that gold mine that everyone was telling me to grab, so that's good. Apparently our truce with Aragon, I think we have a truce with Aragon? What? Before we, they break the alliance. Oh, they're at war with France, and they are, oh, they're owned by Castile. Okay, that changes a lot of things. Um, Castile, Venice is at war, okay. After that, maybe there's a hope, but I don't know. Um, well, that's pretty big. Castile and Aragon against France. Um, we still have Austria and Poland, so it's not a huge concern. And I can go and find somebody else when I'm not at war. Uh, we have 20% war score against Byzantium, which is not too bad either. But let's quickly deal with these rebels. Um, do I want to take anything here? Or do we just leave them? Okay, what, what sort of peace deal could I even get? Okay, yep. Um, could, I mean, could I make them a, a vassal? Is that 34%? That's not impossible, but maybe coalition. It's only Serbia, so it wouldn't be 
Yeah, that wouldn't be too difficult. 34 war score is all we need, so that that's doable, I think. 34. Right, that's not the rebels. These are the rebels. <laughs> Nearly attack somebody else. Free advisor slot. We should probably hire one here. There we go. In you come. Have we got enough money for that? Yeah, we've got plenty of money. Please don't lose to these rebels. <sighs> oh, that was close. We do win. There we go. That's one set of them dealt with. But yeah, we'll try and go win in Byzantium. We'll obviously have to clear out Crete as well at some point. We should. Oh, we're pretty low on numbers and we've got no manpower left, so be very cautious um, about how we do this now. We do probably need to peace out. Maybe Do we let Byzantium off the hook? I think we have to. I think we're getting a bit bit ragged here. Um, they, will they not accept? Oh, wait, I don't want this anymore. Hang on. Papal State doesn't like us or we hand him over. Yep, hand him over. Don't know who he is. Get rid of him. Trade power? No. Can I just have war reps? They wouldn't even take just war reps. That is pretty... Uh, Okay. Fair enough. I've got pretty good war score. I thought they might... Would they accept just a white piece? I mean, at this point, I don't mind. No. Okay, fair enough. Whatever. Okay, let's go and land in Moria. Use my boats. Hopefully they're not going to move their four stack in there. But yeah, let's get everyone over. Deal with them really quickly, and then hopefully we can sort of wrap this up. Oh, they do have this land here as well. Maybe we could get all of it. Um, but let's not get ahead of ourselves just yet. Definitely not getting ahead of ourselves here. Are they going to move? I feel like they are. Nope, they let us just land in their island. We sadly do not have enough troops to siege this out. So let's just uh, go and wreck their four stack. No, crossing penalty. Oh, we'll have to take it now. It's a bit late. Um... There we go. These guys coming in. Hopefully can reinforce successfully. We should be okay <laughs> with the reinforcements. This is getting a little little close. I'm not sure how I'm going to deal with the rebels in Crete. That is an issue for another day though. Um, as long as, what is it, 5 to 10 years is a while. We'll keep, we are keeping a close eye on it. But yeah, there's a lot of rebels. We've got to be very careful. Um... There we go, we did see occupy this. Hopefully that will at least... Can I just peace out? I'm, I'm good. We don't have to take... Well, I mean, if you'll give me some war reps, I guess I'll take war reps. Can I have this? No. Can I have that? No. Yeah, we'll just take war reps. There we go. Job done. Get the war over. It's all fine. Um, okay, I guess we'll put these back on the boat over here for now, just to recover, and then we'll try and get after these rebels as soon as it gets to sort of a reasonable size, maybe like 12,000. Because obviously we did fail last time, so we don't want to have that again. But yeah, there we go. Okay, the Ottomans losing still. What are they up to? 60. Okay, no, they're winning now. Never mind, but not super easy. And France is actually losing against the Iberians. There you go, Lithuania. You can have access. But there we go. We've dragged Venice. Oh my goodness, more rebels. <laughs> We've slowly dragged Venice up the... Uh, I'm going to have to, no, we're going to have to go by boat. So again, we're going to have to leave those guys. Let them be for now. Um, let's make take some action to stabilize everything. We'll mothball our forts to save some money. Yeah, just, we're going to have to let manpower recover. It's very low. We are making nearly 10 ducats a month now. I assume that includes the the Kosovo gold now coming in. Well, at least I believe there's gold. Is, is there any gold? Yeah, there is. There we go, Kosovo. Gain ducats, gain prestige. Let's gain prestige so we don't have any. Although we're probably going to lose it pretty quickly, so maybe we should have gone with the ducats. 17% um, inflation. But yeah, nice bit of income from gold. Uh, nothing huge, but 0.37. And there we go. Yeah, we got Zeta, we got Kosovo. That's pretty good. And we're coring it already. Yeah, that, it just went straight in with that. Good. I don't even remember off asking to do it, but there we go. They're on their way. To be in court, and we'll just deal with the rebels as they sort of pop up. <laughs> there is some just lurking around, but that's fine. Okay, right, get rid of that. National decisions, again, not not so keen on that one. Oh, rebels again. Wait, in the same place as last time? Okay, fair enough. We're gonna, yeah, we're gonna have to deal with a lot of these rebels for a while, so let's, uh... Let's, let's go deal with that. We're not going to be able to fight any wars for a little while. Oh, the Shadow Kingdom. Something just happened. Did we leave the HRE? 
yes, we are out of the HRE now. Um, so there you go. We can. There's going to be a lot more fights within Italy. We can conquer land. Obviously, I'm not too keen on that right now. How are we looking? Like grand scheme of things, military total. We're not looking great compared to some of these. Force limit. We are up there. Um, development is the big one for now. Uh, 204. So we're not bad. So we're four eighth. We're eleventh. So Hungary's at just ahead of us. So we'll bear that in mind. It's not too bad. QQ. We're actually ahead of Austria. Surprise, but there we go. Obviously, fair enough. Um, right. We can now start. Okay. While a lot of things are going hectic, we're not going to be expanding for a little while. What we can do is uh, annex Naxos. That will be another island for us. Just keep us getting stronger. Right. We're up to 9k. Let's just keep these rebels trapped here. But yeah, we do need to get our numbers up a little bit more. And with zero manpower, that is proving just a little difficult. Handle them, handle them. Just all handle them. Wait. Convert Venice. Well, they're not... Wait, is there someone in Venice? Okay, the Crete, the Crete ones are getting close. So we will have to go and deal with that first. Um, actually, these guys did escape. But now I can... Oh, there's still a river. These stupid rivers. Um, causing all kinds of problems. Hopefully we win this. Should have some advantages, I think. Although that is painful. Minus two terrain. Okay, I think we're going to lose. <sighs> Never mind. <laughs> it was going so well. No, nope, we did win. But now I have to wait ages. We're, we're definitely losing Crete, I'm afraid. They might be getting their independence here. Because, yeah, we just lost. I guess there's, there is another way, I guess. Wait, where are mercenaries? Independent army. 14 and 1. Ooh. How much does this cost? 250 ducats. 4.9 monthly maintenance. Um, I mean, we could... Okay, yeah, I'm gonna... Uh, yeah, how do I... Is available to hire. Yeah, could you uh, show up, please? Actually, that's too big, because I can't use... I don't have... How many transports do we have? 13, okay, 15, come here, there we go, boom, quick, and if I quickly, nah, boats don't build that quick, how much is a cog going to take? A year, I don't know if we have a year, but I'll build them anyway, um, hmm, 600 days, yeah, definitely don't have that long, okay, well, even if 13 of them go, that should be enough, hopefully when they rock up, there we go, Mercenary company. Give them their leader, Marco Moro. Oh, we fulfilled a mission. Build to force limit. There we go. That's pretty useful. Boom. So that's that's a mission done. Which usually comes with some nice extras or bonuses. We can't even unoccupy this territory. Oh no, it is a fort. Okay, it is a fort. Fair enough. Um, that is a long time, but I guess we've got to start somewhere, right? We've got to start somewhere, or we will never clear this stuff up. Right, come on, get to full. Once that morale gets to full, or whatever it is, the green bar, we will be going to Crete and hopefully saving the day. Gain five Republican tradition or one stability and lose ten. Okay, stability is zero, but we do need Republican tradition to be up a little bit. Right here they come. Are you? Nope, that didn't work. Is it just gonna tell. Can they not go in boats? Are they? Are they scared of the water? Uh, dude, are you? Are you guys going anywhere? No. Okay, here we go. They should. Nope, they don't work. Okay, mercenaries can't go in boats. Is that that a thing? Because I pressed attach, and it didn't work. But either way, we integrated Naxos. Um. Yeah, I'm so confused. What the heck? Uh, let's bring these all back. I think they had to be in the port, to be fair, but it, I don't know. Hopefully we can get them on there. Or we could be in trouble. Oof, look at France. It's a rough, rough start for them. Right, are you here now? You're in a different port. There we go. Go over there. Come on. Come on, you can do it. Just get on the boat. You're not scared of water. You're fine. Maybe they can't attach to transport. There we go. Yeah, they are not going. Look, they're, they're not. 
detached. Oh no, is it? Okay, maybe they are. But no, they're not going. So I assume they just can't, right? Is that is that right? Wrong to assume that? I don't know. I'm gonna go use them to uh beat up all. The, well, not beat up. Go and try and fix some of the other issues then, and I'll just have to hope this other stack gets pretty pretty beefy pretty quickly of our actual military. I don't know what happened. I don't know why they can't get on the boat. Doesn't really make sense. Maybe they just can't. I don't know. But that, that is a massive trade uh, trade spy network that we don't need. But we've built it up, so we'll stop building that. And that'll be it for this episode. So as always, if you have enjoyed, be sure to leave a like and a comment down below. Be sure to subscribe as well if you are new to the channel. And I'll see you in the next one.